Today's question, what is the best diet for weight loss? I'm gonna give two answers to this. The first one is gonna be realistic and the second one is gonna be absolutely unrealistic and practical, but what really does work. So the first one is the best diet for weight loss is the diet that you can do, that you can sustain, that puts you in a calorie deficit long-term and you'll lose weight. What that diet is for you, I don't know. It might be intermittent fasting, it might be going vegan, it might be zone, it might be you know eating three square meals a day, it might be tracking your calories, it might be if it fits your macros, I don't know. But whatever diet puts you in a calorie deficit where you'll lose weight and you can stick with is the diet for you. Now, what is the best, what is the best diet if you have all options available, you have all the money in the world, What's the best diet? Here it is. Throw all the food out in your house right now. Like throw it all out, all out in the bin. Hire someone, either a chef or a service that will cook your food to exactly the calories and macronutrients you need, protein, carbs, and fat for breakfast, lunch, dinner, and a snack. And that's it. So they deliver your food to your house or cook it to your house and that's it. Yes, I know that means you can't eat out and you can't eat with friends, and you can't eat your family. And it's deeply impractical, and it's super expensive. Um, but yeah, that's the one that all the celebrities do that they don't really talk about, because you know, if a studio is paying you $40 million to look good with your shirt off in a movie, they're not probably gonna trust you to not eat the ice cream. They're probably gonna go, here's your chef, here's your food, shut up, take the money, eat that, go to the gym, and that's it. But that's the reality. If you had the money, to pay someone to literally cook your food or send you the food you, you want at your macros and you would no food in the house, you would be in perfect shape for that picture you want on Instagram. Now, would it be deeply boring, dull, and practical, expensive, like I said? Yes, of course it would. But for that picture, that picture on Instagram would be worth it. But anyway, back to the, back to the first one. Look, the best diet is the one that you can sustain long-term and consistently. That's the best one. And that is different for everyone. Most dieting is behavioral. The science is simple. It's just, you know, being a calorie deficit. But the behavioral stuff, the human stuff is the difficult one because we all have different circumstances. We have kids, we have husbands, we have wives, we have, you know, busy jobs, stressful jobs, different access to food, different, you know, um, amounts of money, different cooking skills. So that's the hard part. So whatever diet you find that puts you in a calorie deficit that you can sustain and doesn't drive you insane, perfect, brilliant, well done. If you can find that, good for you, but that's what you need to do. Find a method that you can maintain, keep you in a calorie deficit to lose the weight you want to lose and then maintain your calorie, maintain, your, maintain that and you'll be golden. All right, guys, I hope that helps. If you have any questions, you can ask in the comments below. And as always, I hope you have a good day. Cheers.